Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop CC tutorial. Guys, I'm in 2020, and it's actually not CC. It's just Adobe Photoshop 2020 now, actually. And uh, guys, I'm going to show you how to fix a image that's too bright, and I'm going to do it in like 90 seconds. It's really fast, really easy, uh, simple tutorial for here to come along with. So anyways, guys, got an image here of Harold. You probably know him from the meme world. And uh, here's how we do it. First step, put the image in, open up Photoshop, drop the image in, of course. The second step is you take the image... And you make a duplicate copy right there. You drop it down on the plus button there on the plus layer, and that creates layer zero copy. The third step, and this might be the last step, guys, and it's kind of weird, but you'll see, is you want to go up here under layers and drop the layer kind or the layer blend mode from normal to do do do. Let's go with multiply, and that could be all you need to do, guys. That was like 30 seconds. Uh, there are some other steps you can take if you got to dial in a little bit better. Uh, for example, you can reduce the opacity. So if you drop it down, and the opacity part of me, this is blending with the bottom. So if you reduce the opacity, it blends with the bottom image. So if you go to 0%, there's no blending. If you go to 100%, it's full. But somewhere around 70%, maybe that's the style or the color you're looking for. That's it, guys. That really is all there is to it. If you want to go further, I'll delete this layer. And I'll show you another t technique. I'll just, well, let's just go ahead and do it again. And now this time, I'm going to go ahead and select. I'm going to actually go up here. Let's try this out. Select subject. And it's going to go ahead and select him. And we just say we want the, we want him to get darker, but we don't want the background to be impacted, for example. And again, this is just demonstration purposes. So we'll go to select. We selected him. Now we're going to select the inverse. So we've selected what's behind him. And now watch this. I'm just going to cut it. So I'm going to go to edit, cut. You still won't see anything. But now when I go to layer zero copy, I'm just going to click on that here. And I'm going to drop it down to we would multiply. You'll notice here that the background still stayed bright. So we only worked on his color here. We worked on his face, but not the background. So that's just another option that you guys can try. I'm going to reduce it down to about 70% opacity. And there you go, guys. We've reduced the brightness of an image with Harold in it in about two minutes time. Thanks for watching. Be back.